There is general consensus that hydrogen is a good alternative to oil-based fuels, but no such consensus on how to use it, whether it should be burned or processed through a fuel cell. Now a UK company believes it may have solved the problem, coming up with a method of storage that could allow us all to use it in our existing cars with only minor modifications. Seller Energy, a spin-off from Oxford University, has developed a method of capturing hydrogen in a powder so fine it behaves like a liquid. Because it's a fluid, you can use some of the existing infrastructure that we use for petrol now. So you can use tankers to carry the material around, you can take it to forecourts and then you can pump it into the vehicle and give a customer the same kind of experience as they have now in their vehicles. The process is based on a novel way of making microfibers, 30 times thinner than a human hair. Seller make the fibers out of hydrides, materials that soak up hydrogen like a sponge. The result looks like tissue paper, and it's this that is then encased in a plastic coating, allowing the hydrogen to be handled in air and poured into your tank. And when you go and refuel your car, you have two nozzles, one which puts in the new beads and one which takes out the old beads that goes off to be recycled and, added, and hydrogen added to it again. All part of the reason the company believes the process could herald a new era of carbon-free motoring, according to CEO Stephen Voller. The experience that most people have now is using regular liquid fuels where it takes three minutes to um, fill your vehicle and then you can travel 300 miles. Now you can have exactly the same experience with hydrogen, but you can't have that experience with an electric car. Seller Energy say their process could power cars and planes. They say it's attracting interest from both the energy and transportation sectors, looking for a game-changing alternative to fossil fuels. Stuart McDill, Reuters, Oxfordshire.